It's time for our basic first mark sheet of the match in this game between Knight Riders and Rajasthan Royals. Let's uh, see how Ajit Agarkar marks players from both teams. Basic first, specialized platform for JEE main, advanced, neat and 6-12. to 12. Right, Ajit, rather convincing win for Kolkata Knight Riders. A lot of youngsters that uh, shine on the day. So let's see how you mark those young players, especially the Indian ones. Starting with Shivam Mavi, a couple of wickets again. How would you mark a Shivam Mavi out of 10? You'd have to give him a 8. Mm-hmm. 8. Uh, look, I, I mean, he's, he's improved with each game. A lot of people will talk about the two victories that KKR have had. But against Mumbai Indians, I watched it live. And he was really good. I think a lot of the other bowlers struggled, but he was he was uh, very good. And in his first game back, and from then on, the confidence has increased. And a couple of wickets, a couple of really key wickets. Uh, even though you would, the, the two batters may not be very pleased with their shots, uh, but the bowling was good, and uh, that is all that counts. And Mavi's uh, impressive. All right. What about Shubman Gill, who top scored for KKR for the second game running? How would you mark uh, Shubman Gill out of ten? Uh, nine, I think. I think just just for the sheer quality of the innings. I know forty-seven. Uh, I'm sure he would have liked to go on and get another big one like the previous one, but it was still the top score uh, uh, for for KKR, and uh, tells you a bit about the batsman. One we've always known the potential that he has, but seems to be trans- transforming that into performances now. And couple of performances in a row is always a good sign for any young player. So, again, a very classy innings against a very hostile Jofra Archer at the start. Uh, real great signs for uh, not just KKR, but Indian cricket. Yeah, and we spoke of Mavi, we spoke of Shubman Gill and Kamalesh Nagarkoti as well. Forms a trio from that same class of uh, young players that they picked, did the Knight Riders. Nagarkoti, a couple of wickets for him, Ajit, and seems a decent pair of uh, hands in the outfield. How would you mark him out of 10? So, uh, incredible athlete for sure. Uh, yeah. If I had to mark him, again, eight like Mavi. Uh, yes, it was a lot easier situation to come in and bowl today, but you still have to bowl well and which he's doing. And with every game, just like Mavi, seems to get, get a bit more confidence, not just in his bowling, but in his body as well. When you've had a couple of injuries and you know been out of competitive cricket or not had a lot of competitive cricket, it's never easy for a young fast bowler. So to come back and uh, start showing some performances and... He seems to be a hell of a fielder. We've seen his uh, athletic ability, the agility he shows in the field. And that's a real bonus for, for any cricketer. So, uh, real positive signs. If those two can keep performing, uh, will make Dinesh Karthik's job a lot easier of picking 11s. Yeah, they saw some high-quality fast bowling in the day, the young fast bowlers. They saw Pat Cummins from their own team, but they saw Jofra Archer first up in this game. So, let's go to players from the Rajasthan Royals. Some spell for Jofra Archer. Ajit, 2 for 18, ends up on the losing side. But I think you might just mark him uh, quite well regardless. Yeah, I think that's a 10. Just just for the sheer quality of that uh, bowling spell. I mean, all four overs really ran in today and just bowl fast. I mean, there was, there was a couple of occasions where he had some variation. Bowled a couple of slower balls, but those then become so much more effective when someone's bowling close to 150 kilometers. We know what kind of quality he has, especially in white ball cricket. He's shown over the years how good he's been. But today was their approach was really good. He just wanted to try and get people out, and that's not an easy thing uh, to do in T20 cricket. So impressive spell. Unfortunately, uh, ended up on the losing team. Yeah, and as we go to the other overseas pick for Rajasthan Royals, that's Tom Curran. You think he was just a stop replacement, stop gap replacement? Ben Stokes is fit, but he's putting in a shift, 147 with the ball and an unbeaten half century to at least reduce the deficit for Rajasthan Royals. How would you mark Tom Curran out of 10 today, Ajit? Yeah, I'd give Tom Curran a six. Yes, uh, more for his batting. I mean, bowled well enough. Uh, you know, you would you would think uh, with the way Jofra was bowling, you probably expect a bit more. Uh, didn't bowl badly, went for a few runs, uh, but the innings was really good. Again, in a losing cause and there was probably a little bit less pressure, but but you can see the quality that he has in batting. And uh, low down the order at number 7 or 8 that he, he would bat for Rajasthan, that's a real bonus. I know Ben Stokes might come at some stage, but till then, if he can do that role, uh, they can then start playing around with other options if he can consistently contribute. So, good day for him with the bat. And finally, we've got another fast bowler. We've got Ajit. So let's see how he marks all these fast bowlers. Ankit Rajput went for 39 of his four overs, but did pick up the big wicket for Andre Russell. At the time, we thought that was tilting the game in Rajasthan's balance. How would you mark Ankit Rajput out of 10, Ajit? Yeah, I think a 7. Just because the approach was right, you can go for runs in this format. It, it can uh, 
it can be difficult some days you don't bowl to poorly uh, but you can still go for runs and someone like andre russell you bowl to you make one mistake he bowled a one ball which was a length ball before he got the wicket and that was that landed in the stand so that's how difficult it is you can't afford to make mistakes against those players so the approach was right bowled aggressively which is which is always a good sign uh, does have a little bit of pace uh, and because he's a bit tall does get a bit of bounce and the idea was right just the wide yorker to andre russell with the field in uh, put in place uh, and when you try and ex- or do the right things or at least think about it the right way generally the results follow if uh, if not today uh, tomorrow and uh, that's what i liked about his approach all right ajit agarkar thank you very much for marking players from both the kolkata night riders and the rajasthan royals that rounds up our basic first mark sheet of the match basic first specialized platform for jee main advanced neat and 6 to 12